There is a new Mamba model, which is what we're going to discuss in this video. If you are completely new here, Mamba is an alternative architecture, a state space model architecture, which is alternative to transformers. Transformers is one of the most popular deep learning architectures today and all the large language models are at least most of the large language models that you see are built on top of transformers. The problem is transformers when you increase the context length it doesn't require computer memory linearly in fact it requires quadratically so that creates a problem in scaling up transformers and that is why people started looking for alternatives and that is where mamba is very interesting we have seen a lot of mamba related content in this video on this channel and the latest one is a very new model and this actually indicates that Mamba has a really great future. So I'm going to show you in this video how to use the latest Mamba 2.8 billion Instruct Open Hermes model and on Google Collab. So you can run this model yourself on Google Collab. I've already prepared the Google Collab. I'll share it with you. But before that, let's quickly look at the model in itself. This model is uh, from Clebrain, but it is created by a favorite model creator of mine, Manuel Romeo. So this model is there, which is Mamba 2.8 billion parameter model, instruct fine tune on the Open Hermes dataset. Now Open Hermes dataset is a very popular dataset to be honest. It's completely permissive and uh, that is powering the Open Hermes model. So we know all know like how good Open Hermes model is. So the model itself should be good be depending upon the dataset that we have got. So what is the combination of Open Hermes dataset? Open Hermes dataset has got 242,000 entries, primarily GPT-4 generated. It's a combination of the following GP teacher, which has got a role playing and code instruct data set. This is by Technium, Wizard LM, um, you might expect like a lot of math, Aeroboros, Camel AI's domain experts, Code Alpaca by Hell, and GPT-4 LM and unnatural instructions. This is like uh, by filtering some existing data set. So this is all part of the 242,000 entries that basically went inside Open Hermes data set. Now this is what has been used to fine tune the Mamba 2.8 billion data set and that is has given us this particular model. We don't have a lot of information on the model cardinal in itself. It has got a strange license WTFPL. I tried to find out what this meant. Um, I didn't know. Uh, I don't know if it is somebody trying to troll us or not. But anyways, that's the license we have got. So now how do we run this on Google Collab? Uh, thanks to Manuel Romeo who has also shared the code with us which works very perfectly except like one issue that I've managed to fix it. So first you need Torch, PyTorch, then you need Transformers, then you need Causal, Conv1D, and Mamba SSM. So these are the four libraries that you need. My Google Collab in this case, I'm running it on GPU. So if you go to runtime, click change runtime, you can see it's T4 GPU. But when I share this Google Collab notebook with you, you can basically run this without GPU also. So the way you can run it is you can go click here, run all, that's it. Once you go give click here and run all like click runtime and run all. So it will start installing the libraries. Next, there was a small error uh, on Google Collab. I'm not sure if this error will persist if you're running it on local GPU. Let's say I've got a 4080, 4090. So maybe it will not uh, be there, but uh, something to keep in mind. Right now, this is running on an NVIDIA GPU. So if you do not have an NVIDIA GPU, Honestly, I did not try it, but the code lets you use it if you have CPU also, but I'm not sure how efficient or how fast it would run. So this is primarily to fix that NVIDIA GPU error um, where we have uh, a symbolic link. But once that is like fixed, then all you need is import torch, very typically like how we would do with any uh, transformer models. And then from transformers, import auto tokenizer, auto model for causal LM. Uh, primarily the auto tokenizer we are importing to get the tokenizer and uh, the mod Mamba model will be loaded with Mamba LM head model which comes from Mamba SSM. Then this model actually the fine tuned data it follows the chat template of Zephyr 7 billion beta. So the chat template ID comes from there. So this line says if you have GPU CUDA then you can enable CUDA if not you go with CPU and this is the exact model in itself. Now is the time where we are going to set the EOS token. So this is basically to tell the chat template or the model, um, the instructions when the particular sentence actually ends from the model response in itself. You set the EOS token, you get the tokenizer and then you get the chat template and then you load the model from Mamba LM head model 
dot from tree train the model name which is directly copied from here this is the model name from hugging faces model up device in this case CUDA but if you have CPU CPU I'm not sure how it works and then the data type once this is done run it it should be at this point you should have downloaded the model this step might take a little bit of time but at this point you should have downloaded the model you should have set the tokenizer you are completely ready to go the next thing is instead of making this a simple one one question and answer this code actually lets you have a chat i'll tell you how that happens that primarily happens thankingly for the list so this creates a python list called messages and uh, that messages basically appends all the conversation so if you go here first is the user question what is the user question tell me five places to visit in bangalore so their assistant answers then the user just simply says maybe in chennai but the assistant still understands that are in this case the mamba model still understands that i'm talking about five places to visit in chennai not just simply anything about chennai so it still gives me an answer this is primarily a list you can see it is all part of a list or a kind of like a json structure not necessarily so it's a list and inside that you're going to send a prompt with the role user so you're converting that uh, this into a dictionary so which is like a role plus prompt the prompt is where you ask the question and that goes get appended into the messages and at this point the messages would be empty it's an empty list you append it then you take that and apply the chat template and send it through the tokenizer and send it to the C gpu device and then you use model.generate to ultimately generate the output so here we are using a max a length of 2000 tokens you can play with that i didn't find on the model card what is the context window at of this particular model but i assume it might be 2048 so we are sticking to 2000 so typically transformer models when you say 2000 it would one take a lot of time but when you have more conversations you will start hitting out of memory error but in this case actually you can see it's quite flat for me uh, i still do not do like an equal uh, apple to apple comparison between mamba and a transformer based model with a similar size on google collab to see what is the difference but at least like i can feel that maybe it is not hitting out of memory oom error the next thing is once we get the output then we have to decode it once we decode it and get the message separately we can append the message back to the dictionary in itself the messages dictionary i'm sorry the messages list so that the messages are there like the assistant message is there with the role assistant and print the message what was the question i asked tell me five sites to visit in bangalore give me mysore palace St. Mary's Church, Kaban Park, Vidana Sauda, Lalbag Fort. Good places, anybody would recommend. Then to keep the conversation going on, instead of the messages, means I didn't want to again make it empty, I went ahead and then said, okay, maybe in Chennai and the rest of the things remain the same. So it gives me Marina Beach, Fort St. George, Anna Square, Anna Square, Chinna Tambi Reddige Temple and Chennai Central Railway Station. Good, well and good. So I'm going to quickly show you how I'm going to do it. And if you see, this is how the messages list look like. We asked a question, the assistant response, and we asked another question, which is user and the assistant response. So user, assistant, user, assistant. Let me go ahead, copy the last line. Once you have pasted it, you can say anything. So you can keep the conversation going on. So for example, um, how about, um, let me just say, France, maybe not France, um, Germany. And ideally it is supposed to give me five places in G Germany to visit. That's that's the whole idea, whether it keeps the conversation going. And whenever you want to reset the conversation, all you have to do is reset the list. If you make the messages list empty, you should be technically, yeah, it sticks to it. So it gives me Berlin Wall Memorial, uh, Brandenburg Gate, Pergamon Museum, Berlin Wall Memorial. Once again, it repeated, it repeated, okay. Anyways, I didn't have enough information about Berlin maybe. So the next thing that I wanted to try is very simply, I'm going to go here and then say, tell me five places to visit with itinerary or with, um, let's say uh, itinerary, maybe not itinerary. Tell me five places to visit in Bangalore in one day and give me the response in JSON. So the reason why I'm asking this question is because I've known that open hermes model itself is really good in giving json responses so i wanted to see because this is open hermes data set and whether you know the mamba can at least like try to do that 
and again this requires like extensive testing this is not a model testing or quality of the model video in itself i just wanted to say that people have started fine tuning mamba models and it is quite exciting but because i've taken this liberty to test this model i thought okay why not ask this model to give the response in json so here uh, this is the json response it gives sites okay because that's what we said five sites name address opening hours description name address opening hours description and okay i think it's decent it, it it has done a pretty good job of putting this in json so we have like a proper json file here so you can see here it is a decent json and um, the the structure is quite intact and uh, it hold, it would hold true if we try to do a json formatting so overall i'm quite excited for this model and if you want to try this model please go ahead give a star here should mean oh, i have to log in should mean a lot to the developer but uh, otherwise i'll link the google collab notebook in the youtube description for you to directly go ahead and then play with it and still if you see our memory is quite flat like we are not going up it's quite flat but it will be a very good experiment for me to check take a 3 billion parameter transformer model now 2.8 billion parameter mamba model then compare it and then see how the out of memory happens like uh, let's see if that is a that is a test that i could do it but otherwise i'm really excited about mamba and i hope i can bring more mamba content see you in another video happy prompting